now the banks here in Brazil I'm gonna prove it to you that since my last video since that uh, that countdown the horrible countdown that the guy talked about anti-abortion and all that shit it was just a disguise and disinformation for a financial meltdown you know what I mean so since that day it was not a coincidence since that day when the countdown you know it, it got to zero things here in Brazil started getting worse and worse and, and worse. I was trying to call the bank the bank says like this we are on strike you cannot talk to us right now go to our website fuck that right let's go to the banks right now let's check it out yeah so we're heading to the main east banks in the city and we're gonna check them out right now because uh, right now you know people are starting to complain for real because there are numerous people like a lot of people saying that they're not able to complete their bank transactions and money is getting lost in the middle of you know these transactions you know and these are families that are centuries years old you know what I mean and they control the money for for thousands of years it's like it's not they don't have money dude let me tell you the banks are on strike because people want the communist government back you know the banks they want the co the communist government to come back and reinstate a lot of trolls commenting in on my channel saying that that this that this bank strike shit was just a minor thing to you to me it's gonna know normal just normal you know right now it's winter here in Brazil and it's 30 fucking five degrees but you are probably paying attention so this is just, this is gonna happen to you pay attention right now Okay guys, so we're here now, we're gonna check out some banks. Hey guys, this is one of the biggest chains in Brazil, this is uh, Itaú, you know what I mean? Like, let me see here if I can catch the name, there you go, right? Uh, one of the biggest chains here, they're on strike still, today's the 27th, okay? And then we're gonna ask some random person right here what day today is, let's see here. Opa, tudo bom? Meu grande, me fala, tudo bem? Eu tô fazendo um vídeo aqui pra internet só pra registrar quantos dias estão em greve, cara. Você, me, você registra aqui pra mim, não precisa ser sua cara, só me fala que dia que é hoje. Hoje, 27 em inglês, é 27, né? 27, 27, 27, 27, ok. Thank you very much. Mas fala uns 20 e poucos dias mesmo que tá aí, né? 20 days, 20 é. dias, 20 é. dias em greve. 22 dias, mas... 22, 22, 22 days on strike. Yeah. Ok, guys, so that was it, you know, like, um, just conf a first confirmation here that it's the 27th. So anyway... I just got return to my car right now and we are going to another bank. Okay, right now we're on this other shopping mall. We're gonna ch test out if we have other banks on, on from other ban branches on strike. Also, I've just showed you other banks from, for example, Citibank is on strike. Other banks are on strike. So I'm gonna try to go inside here, you know, and show, show it more thoroughly. See you later.
what you gotta do right now, we gotta unite ourselves and we gotta do this differently, okay? Yo, what's up guys, this is James from the Impossible Channel. We're gonna be checking out the banks here in Brazil. I'm gonna prove it to you that since my last video, since that uh, that countdown, that horrible countdown that the guy talked about anti-abortion and all that shit, it was just a disguise and disinformation for a financial meltdown, you know what I mean? So since that day, it was not a coincidence, since that day, when the countdown, you know, it, it got to zero, things here in Brazil started getting worse and worse now and worse. I was trying to call the bank, the bank said like this, we are on strike, you cannot talk to us right now, go to our website. Fuck that, right? Let's go to the banks right now and let's check it out. Yeah, so we're heading to the main East Banks in the city and we're gonna check them out right now. Because uh, right now, you know, people are starting to complain for real because there are numerous people, like a lot of people saying that they're not able to complete their bank transactions and money's getting lost in the middle of, you know, these transactions, you know. And these are families that are centuries, years old, you know what I mean? And they control the money for 